I was actually a little inspired by this collection. J Manual Beauty is actually now the makeup sponsor for BCBG Max Azria Runway. So we actually did the makeup today and we'll be doing the future shows. And we really wanted to pare down the makeup look with um, really perfecting them. They're wearing my Skin Perfector Foundation, which is under that whole filter finish umbrella um, because it has filtering properties in it. So it gave them this perfect look with this kind of, we gave the, the girl this glow with um, skin facelift, which is done with real crushed gemstones. So in, nine, in 2017, we're committed to be at least 70 to 75% recycled. So we are doing, and thanks to Pentagonia and all the other amazing companies that have been doing, you know, really turning the industry around because about 10 years ago when we wanted to go into recycled yarn, recycled texture, you know, recycled yarns and technique like dyeing process to be more um, better for environment. Nobody wanted to do it and it was costing a fortune. Now with um, the widespread of people asking for it, we can actually afford it, which is fantastic. So we're committed to going as green as we can. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to announce it more. This is like a little prelude to it, but I'm very, very excited because it's giving back. You know, I want the future of our children to be green in reality. So we're, it's very important that the company like BCBG and, of course, all our other divisions, you know, turn around and do something better. I love this whole idea of, I like to say renew and, and um, uh, really kind of protect our, our kind of mother earth. Um, Luba loves to say recycle. So if you notice the fabrics were really modern and cutting edge in terms of this mixed media and the cut, but the fabrics really had this sense of things that were biodegradable, things that were of the earth. And so that was really, really con a, a conscious effort on their part. We really connect and bond on this idea of of um, really making a conscious effort for what kind of what we can do because with a lot of modern fabrics today that are synthetics they're really polluting and they don't biodegrade and so I love the collection yes it was so beautiful I want all of those like best fur situations they're beautiful it's fantastic I think it's great to have such beautiful faux fur, I mean, what more could you want? It's eco-friendly and it's also fashionable. It was inspired by that little girl which likes to perform, likes to do little dance, and obviously by David Bowie. Uh, and uh, it's, you know, what's so beautiful about uh, BCBG uh, is that they always kind of connect us with something playful. And uh, and I think we need to uh, we need to connect with that because life can be sometimes very serious. And I think we need to find ways to be playful, if it's through uh, making our friends laugh or through uh, dressing in a playful way. I just love how like fun it is and it's feminine and it, you like can play with colors and patterns and shapes and lengths and like it's just like a bunch of like beautiful stuff. BCBG was great. I loved it. There was like a bit of whimsy to it, which I thought was very fun. Obviously, it was still kind of structured and tough, which I liked, but there were these elements of like just, you know, tutu kind of elements and like sparkly legging girl elements. And it was a very cool tie. Luba and I had a great conversation about it afterwards, about like preserving that inner performer in every little girl. There was a little girl stuck in every outfit. It was the little glitter, the little tutu. Yeah. Well, I think for me, I need versatility more than anything. I need to be able to go out in something during the day that is like a t-shirt and jeans and then to throw on a blazer at night, whether I'm coming from set or from college, 
so that I can go to a red carpet thing or a dinner. I just need to be able to do things easy and fast. I'm not one to like put a lot of time into getting ready. I think today was like the most time I've, I've put into that in a very long time. So I like one, two, three situations and to have as fashionable and chic a one, two, three situation as their line allows you to have is pretty great. I think it changes depending what, what it is. Um, like today, I went more playful. Yeah, it's a VCVG, yeah, a VCVG. So I think it, you know sometimes you can do it more, and sometimes you have to be a little bit more professional when I speak at the conferences. And so you have to depending on uh, on what you are doing. But I'll definitely like a little bit of uh, playfulness. Super rich, super rich in the sense of recycle. Like I couldn't help when I got dressed today. I was like, I needed to, down in my bag, I felt like I needed to echo a little bit of the collection. Technology is moving so much forward. So the fashion to me, at least in my eyes, starts kind of regressing back. So it's more about tactile things, more about handmade, more about things that have value. You know, better association versus, you know, high-tech fabrication that's going to take you to the moon. You know, I, I really don't care so much about that. I care about things that make you feel being present in the moment. That to me is important.